Another new feature here for C Electrical V8R4 Service Pack 2 and this is adding attributes which allow you to customize the filter when you're putting equipment onto a, onto a symbol. So if I place in a circuit breaker as an example and I go to the insert text, control T and I'll just put a question mark for now. In the attributes I'll go down to the bottom to say this is going to be an equipment attribute and I'm going to start with the current rating. So I'm going to place that just to the right. I'm then going to leave it on a question mark and I'm going to go down to current tripping characteristics and I'm going to add that one. So two bits of text, I need to make those part of this symbol. So I'm going to select those, right click and choose add to block. Click on the symbol and now I have two attributes. Now in VHL4 I can modify this text whereas previously this would have been locked because it's coming from the equipment but if I set this as a particular value so I now put this as being type C and 125 amp if I now search for a part number it uses those two values to filter the parts database to provide a list of suitable parts so I can now see a list of parts and I can see the filter at the bottom current equals 125 time tripping characteristic equals C now the parts I've got are for four pole three pole for a variety of different sizes so I can actually put in there that this is one pole press enter and it's now filtering on a third field of information and once I found a suitable part I can double click click on OK and now I've got the part number information on there. Notice that the attributes now are locked. I can't change those because they are now dependent on the equipment. When you're using this, make sure that under functions and open database, in the settings, or choose selectable, that the attributes that you're interested in are selectable on the drawing. So they need to be checked to make sure that that's the case. But a nice new feature, for streamlining the selection of equipment.